A 10-year-old Orange County girl's family is desperately trying to find out what caused her sudden death. Police think she died by suicide and may have been bullied. Kick Online Orange County reporter Stacy Butler live for us in Santa Ana with more on this really heartbreaking story. Stacy. Yeah, Sarah, as detectives here at the Santa Ana Police Department continue to investigate what they are calling an apparent suicide, the family members I spoke with tonight refuse to believe it. We want people to remember her, like who she was, not think that she was a sad little girl that was in some, you know, horrible depression because that wasn't the truth. On the third night of a nine day prayer vigil, the family of 10 year old Allison Wendell is desperate for answers. Do you believe that she committed suicide? I don't believe it. I don't. She was always just happy. Like, why would she want to do that to herself? Actually, Police are investigating just how the outgoing funny fifth grader who loved to dance and roller skate died in the bathroom of her family's mobile home on Sunday. Detectives are scouring Wendell's social media accounts as they investigate what they are calling an apparent suicide. Monday, police showed up at her school to follow leads. The 10 year old had been bullied, but her family says that was a one time incident a month ago that couldn't have led to her death. I didn't like the fact that they started saying it was because of bullying, because I, we don't want to point fingers right now, because we don't want someone to feel guilty for something that we don't know it was for sure. We're hoping it's an accident. <laughs> you know, we're hoping that this is just her being funny and playing around and maybe something went wrong. Bonnie Messina says Allison had too much to look forward to to harm herself, including a trip to Six Flags with her favorite cousin. To know that she's not here and that I won't be able to do that anymore, it breaks my heart because that's all I remember. The last time she spoke to me and she just gave me a big hug and I said, I love you. Now the family has started to go fund me page. They're trying to raise money for funeral expenses and also for therapy for her eight year old sister who discovered her. That's the very latest from Santa Ana. Back to you guys in the studio. Just such a sad story, Stacy. Thank you. If you are concerned a friend or a loved one might be thinking about harming themselves, please call the National Suicide Prevention Hotline at 1-800-273-TALK. Trained counselors are available 24 hours a day, seven days a week to help.